<laughs> I'm Alejandro. I'm from Puerto Rico. I'm actually from the University of Puerto Rico in Mayaguez. Even though I'm a mechanical engineering major and I've worked with various um, research before um, developing different type of instrumentation, this is my first time working with biological related research. So in our lab, we're working on a range of different types of neural implants and platforms for diagnosing and treating neural disorders, specifically mood disorders like anxiety and depression that affect um, a lot of American citizens and citizens around the world. The critical part of this platform is we have these probes that go into very specific neural circuits inside the brain, and we want to infuse drugs to those circuits. So when you came in a couple weeks ago, I know we had some part of this set up. Um, how have you felt working with it? Do you think we can make it better? Definitely. Right now, what I'm targeting on is how I can like control the different aspects of the pump, trying to leave everything as static as possible. So that'll be really important for when we want to make these um, smaller and implantable, because not only do we not want movement of the needle, but we also don't want moving of this central actuation portion. Right, so the new setup that we're looking forward to and what, what I'm working with the design, it's uh, <laughs> instead of having like modular setups, so we have the electrical um, dock in one place and then the tubing dock in another place separately, what I'm looking for is to have all of it um, combined so we have we know exactly how much initial pressure we're putting there, and that prevents us from having bubbles like on the long term, which okay. is really important. That's actually very important for when we're building prototypes, is we want to take apart every little piece and think about how can we make this part better, and that part better, and then at the end we can put it all together. So what we're trying to achieve here is get the setup to be as small as possible, and this is very important because the type of work that we are doing requires the pump to be implantable, so that's our main target here. I've worked with other research projects before, and most of them were in instrumentation development. This one is also instrumentation development, which was really good, so I was able to see the overview of the project quick and be comfortable with it. And the chair on top is that it's related to neuroscience, which has been a topic that I've been really dying to learn. I'm very excited to know that my work might help others' lifestyles be better in the future.